There is a place where the lost embers go. As the light begins to fade. The wall glistened. Emperor felt so afraid and alone that it was a relief to find someone to talk to. Ember froze, almost too frightened to look away, when they noticed a small satchel. felt heavy. Embo looked inside. The statue shone brightly in the light. There was a symbol on the floor. There was a symbol on the floor. Embo noticed something wrong. There was a round space where something used to fit. To Ember's delight, the golden statue slid perfectly into place. Ember left, feeling sorry for the stranger now alone in the dark. The stairway opened into a dark forest. Ember could feel fear taking over. They'd washed up alone, somewhere very unfamiliar. felt like they were being watched. As Ember approached, the flames With a feeling like falling, the forest had slipped away. Ember felt lost in darkness and ruin.
caged flame stokes new hope in Ember. within reach. The flame spoke and Ember listened. The flame lingered ahead. Was it trying to escape? Or leading the way? into life. The ghost spoke. Hope has returned to a forlorn. I will warm them until they choose to move on. Ember looked to the ghost for answers. This is a place between places to travel through as your light fades, but none have passed on in a long time. The Forest King now holds us here, and those who linger will turn forlorn. Again that word, forlorn.
The forlorn are those who lost their way along the path. If you find them, send them to me and I will guide them. I am just a guide along the way to fan the flame. So many lost embers have I seen, more than I could help. Ember thought of those they loved, those they'd left behind. There are others lost to look. Find them and I will guide them. The forest king, the campfire will light the way. Find those who are lost, bring embers to the fire. Travel wisely. Return if you have lost your way. The ghost said, Speak and I will listen. Step backwards, little ember. Look behind. Upon a small grassy cliff rests a forlorn 